Okay, we're back. So, I, uh, okay, we're back. So, I took the strings off, uh, looked at the bridge a little bit. I took off the pickups uh, to take a look and see what they look like. Uh, this does appear to be, interestingly enough, a piece of maple top, which I was really surprised. I was fully expecting a veneer to be on there, but uh, it does appear to be, you know, a real maple cap. Very surprising. Uh, the pickups, however, uh, are not wax potted, so they're probably going to squeal a little bit uh, if I crank the gain. Uh, and I don't know what they're going to sound like. We'll, you know, we'll find out a little bit. I'm just going to noodle around a little bit with my practice amp here. I don't want to overdrive the mic on that video recorder, uh, so I won't get too loud. But uh, the bridge, I adjusted a little bit to get the action down. Um, it adjusts pretty well. Uh, I hear a little bit of buzzing on the B string with it. Uh, but I'm hoping that the string will just kind of settle down in it, this new string. So uh, anyway, overall, so far so good. Let's, uh, let's see if the pickups work okay. So we'll start off in the first position there. Helps if I turn the amp on. Well, I'm going to turn down the gain, just kind of play it clean. Let's try the middle position and see if it's older. It's a little better. things to squeal or to a stronger amp but everything seems to be working okay I mean the pickups are probably the weakest part of the the overall picture the frets are pretty good the neck feels good you know everything on it feels okay you know uh, I guess the moral of the story is you know you get what you pay for I mean this is not a Gibson uh, but if you want an inexpensive guitar you know, there's something to just bang around with or something to take on as an experiment guitar or a hot rod or whatever. You know, might not be a bad option. Again, I don't re recommend you buy one of these. If you do, I recommend you design a headstock. And if I ever buy another one, that's what I'll do. I'll uh, design a logo and have them put that on the headstock. 
Uh, so again, I'm not here to recommend you buy one of these, but uh, it was an experiment that uh, overall I have to say I'm a little more impressed than I thought I would be. So that's that. Thanks for tuning in, and uh, we'll see you next time where we probably look at another great American guitar. See you later.